thumbs up for finally being out of the flashback and back to this awesome battle. What's up, everybody? For Never World here today to do my review of Naruto Chapter 585. And I'm just happy to be out of that flashback and get some craziness with this chapter because it's awesome. It was great. I really enjoyed it. Uh, basically, in this chapter, we get uh, Sasuke and Itachi versus... Um, Kabuto once again, and this time, like, the battle is getting more intense, it's, you know, heating up even more, so, and first of all, for the theory that Izanami was already in effect, and that's why we were getting the flashback, so far, it seems that that was out the window, unless Itachi is lying in this chapter, because basically he says at the end of the chapter, right, I'm gonna start Izanami now, and he gets cut in half right there, so that means that Izanami wasn't in effect this whole time, and basically, it was just, you know, we, us getting a flashback. So the theory of Izanami being in effect is pretty safe to say it's out the window unless Itachi is, uh, was lying and the whole time, you know, he has been. But uh, right now it seems it's gone. And basically when they go at it, Kabuto basically has like a bunch of people coming out of his stomach. I believe he had Kimi Maru, the, the sound for I believe came out. And then at the end he had Orochimaru there and he said, he tried to act like him and Itachi shut him down. That was hilarious in my opinion. I thought that was funny when he's like, you could try to imitate him, but you can never be a Orochimaru. I was like, Itachi, ever since he came into this fight, he had jokes, but gosh, man, he shut Kabuto down. That was great. Um, had me laughing. This was one of those chapters that I, like, I was like, wow. It was intense. Had me laughing when he shut him down. He was like, I am trying to find myself. <laughs> it was so funny. And uh, basically, it kind of destroyed a little bit because a lot of people kept on saying, no, uh, Kabuto is Orochimaru already, but... From the looks of it, the way he was portraying it and, you know, Itachi shutting him down is basically that he's not. He just right now had Orochimaru. Like, you know, he could display him and make it seem like it, but he isn't Orochimaru. At the end of the day, he is Kabuto. And basically, that's what this chapter for me was, was the big shocking thing and big important thing that the theory of him already being Orochimaru is out the window. He's trying to find who he is and he's trying to act like he's a road tomorrow but then you know Itachi shuts him down and I, I just thought that that was hilarious um the battles at the end of the chapter I, I'm wondering exactly what's going on is Kabuto during the end of the chapter already under the Izanami when he slices Itachi in half because if not things are going to get really crazy and uh still got my prediction in there that it's going to take Sasuke to end this whole thing with Kabuto but yet they don't want to kill him that's the thing so it's going to be very difficult overall chapter one of the things I I guess, you know, a criticism of it is the art style for a couple of the pages, literally like two pages, was a little bit hard to decipher. I was like, mm, exactly what happened in the scene, but for the most part, it was just because it was intense action, and Keisha was showing that in a very, like, rugged way, so, you know, forgive him for that, and overall, just getting out of that flashback and getting to this greatness of a battle I'm, I'm excited definitely uh sasuke and itachi's teamwork in this one definitely really good they're listening to each other they actually did which kind of confused me if maybe kabuto was under a genjutsu when he attacked itachi because they both looked at each other and did a sukiyomi um sharingan combination so i'm wondering what was that about and exactly is that a precursor to basically Kabuto's already on the genjutsu you know there's a lot of trickery in this battle which is good they're using strategy if it was just like hey, I'm going to zap you away, then it wouldn't be much of a fight. But they're using strategy, and he's trying to get to his enemy. It's not just that he has this ace in the hole, that bam, it's over. He's trying to use it. So, you know, using strategy to get to there, great stuff. Definitely not just giving them an easy win. Kabuto's putting up a fight, but it's just hilarious, man. Itachi needs his own comedy show because... That guy has become so funny ever since he got into this battle. I don't know what came over him. Uh, Sasuke he still looks a little bit like, you know, unsure of things and stuff like that. But he is trying his best and he's listening to his brother, which is great. Finally listening to him. And overall, again, really good chapter. Glad it went back to the fight. Uh, Kabuto's crusty for trying to pretend he's a Rochimaru and getting shut down by Itachi. Uh, best moment in my opinion the whole road tomorrow thing and towards the end it's just kind of a little bit pathetic in Kabuto's way because he's like I am trying to find myself the very last thing so um we'll see what happens as far as his enemy goes any predictions what its enemy is going to be because we still got probably next chapter I'll say we'll figure out exactly what his enemy is and I'm looking forward to seeing what that bad boy does because from the way he described it a couple chapters ago it can decide fate so what does that mean? Um, 
good stuff. Uh, but that's all I have for this review. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Once again, thumbs up for being back to this awesome battle with these great freaking characters. And, you know, even, by the way, shutting down the whole Uchiha thing, uh, Itachi said, you know, Uchiha means nothing. It's just our blood relation. It's who you are that makes you who you are. And Kabuto's, like, obsessed with that. So it reminds me, like, of Orochimaru, too, as far as that goes. So it's still a possibility it could be Orochimaru faking everything but I highly doubt that and it just shows Kabuto's obsession to find who he is he would love right now to be in Uchiha which is crazy but yeah I'm just rambling uh that's all I have I'm for Neville World and as always people till next time have an awesome day